Hey there, and welcome back to another video. For today's video, I'm going to show you a very simple and easy way to set live timers and countdowns in Discord. This is a great way in order to coordinate certain times and countdowns for Discord messages on servers. You can use this in order to set countdown timers for events, prizes, giveaways, etc. So, in order to start setting live timers and countdowns on any Discord server, you want to go to the website shown here, hammertime.cu forward slash en dash gb. By using this free open source third party application, we can set a date and time and even set live timers and countdowns on Discord servers. To show a quick explanation of what you're seeing on the Hammer Time website, you can choose the specific date and time, choose a time zone in the entire world if you're choosing, and you can see the chat syntax and how that will show when you apply it to a Discord text. For example, if we choose the 31st of July 2023 and the time to be 7.29, when we copy the chat syntax as shown below, you'll see the example result of how exactly it'll show to everyone viewing it on Discord, regardless of where their actual time zone is. What makes this so useful is that it'll display the correct time and date with the correct time zone for anyone viewing it, regardless of wherever they are. So in order to access the chat countdown feature, you want to look for the icon with the person and the clock next to him. That is the countdown chat syntax we were looking for. So go ahead and copy that code from the Hammer Time website, paste it to your text chat on Discord of choice, and you want to add the capital letter R after a colon on the end of that chat, within the syntax, of course. And as you can see, after we send the chat syntax, it'll show whether the time that we chose on Hammer Time will be before or after the current time based on Discord servers. And there you go, you now know how to set timers and countdowns on Discord using the third-party Hammer Time app. That's really all there is to it, so thank you so much for watching another video with us. Like this video if you feel like you learned something new, and for any other questions or inquiries, as usual, leave them down in a comment below. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you guys in the next one.